UTFO, Google them, look them up. They had the battle with Roxanne. Yo, Kango, I don't think that you're French, because you're going out the shit. Experience, you should know. She doesn't need a guy like you, she needs a guy like me, with a high IQ. And she takes to my rap, uh, my rap uh, best. Uh, Educate a rapper, keep everybody on the best. <laughs> but when I bet her, she bet me no mind. She, she knows it, it ain't mine. Yo, they started me rapping. Indeed. And he's still where the Kango. Absolutely, man. I got to The Kango kid, UTFO. Um, Kango from UTFO. She's a soul. I said, so. Baby, don't you know? I can sing, rap, dance in just one show. Because I'm um, Kango. Mr. Sophisticated. <laughs> <laughs> I know ain't nobody greater from beginning to end and to beginning. I never lose because I'm all about winning. But if I was to lose, I wouldn't be upset. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I bet y'all got further than a lot of motherfuckers yes. did, I'm telling you. All right. <laughs> Why you say that? Because you wouldn't give a brother like me no rap. And then he get in some alacidi lucido. Oh, baby, why you diggle? Is that is because that because then kizzle? That's the end of the rap. I don't know how I got there that quick. I miss a whole, I miss like 14 and a half bars. What happened to the 14 and a half bars? Something's wrong. I was walking down the street, said hello, and I can't go from the UTFO. You said so, so guys, baby, don't you know? I can do my, I just smoked a lot of blood since then. Fucking Kango kid in the building, I'm a little fucked up. We in BB Kings, I don't give a fuck, nigga. Yo, I want the youth juice. This nigga drinking right here. This nigga still look like he, he's still in 1991 right now. Where is Bar? I want the youth juice. I know y'all got it hiding it somewhere. Roxanne, Roxanne, I was with my moms on 169th and 3rd Avenue. Young boy in the supermarket with her when that joint first came out. And they played it on the radio, and I was going crazy because I never heard nothing like it. No, no, because I, I was a baby when it came out. <laughs> Make a brother feel old. Make a brother feel old, why don't you? But, Good looking out. <laughs> Make I want to thank feel. my man for paving the way for me, though. Oh, that man. I can definitely say. Oh, man. I, I accept, appreciate man. you, baby. Oh. What's up, y'all? This is Snake Rick. You know what I mean? And I, I want to I wanna welcome my homeboy back on the St. Kang going on. And um, Roxanne and New Orleans. You got the real Roxanne, you got Roxanne Chante. When I heard the guys do Roxanne, Roxanne, that was the track. That was the bomb. And um, they asked me to audition. They said, do you know that song, Roxanne, Roxanne? And I was like, who doesn't know Roxanne, Roxanne? <laughs> who doesn't know Roxanne, Roxanne? I was like, what? I was actually, I was actually honored, honored, so that I could audition for the part. And here I am. <laughs> no, 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 I did not say that. I did not say that. I love this woman. I love her. 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 Look. Google it. It's the other rock saying he was going to make it. First of all, it's big influence to me. Even though we started around the same time. When Roxanne Roxanne hit off, and we were performing at the same spot, so I was an opening act back then. It was just great to be around him and to know that my boy is doing it. He was my first friend and still my friend in, in this industry. And you know it's really hard to make friends in this industry. I'm really proud of him. I'm proud of his kids. I see that his legacy continues, and I wish him nothing but the very best. K7, TK, and Beats him out. Kango, love! I say one thing about Kango, always a consummate professional. I remember, I think we was in, um, I want to say Denver, Colorado, but I'm not really sure what state. I know it was cold, and we had been on the bus, and it was Salt and Pepper and UTFO and myself. Oh, I'm the great one, Dana Dan. You can't tell by the hat wear, but it's me under here. And I think it was Kango. Kango, if I'm wrong, hey, sue me. But I think he gave everybody strep throat. He was sick as a dog and the next thing I know, everybody was sick. So, Pepper, we had to bring a doctor. The doctor had to come backstage. We was all finished, man. And I'm blaming you, Kango, because that's whose name comes up first and that's who I remember. <laughs> the great one, Danny Dan. I love you, my brother. Keep doing what you do. And that's one thing about you. You never stop. You keep doing what you do. I love that about you, man. Blessings and love. Full circle. Diggy.